PL most welcome yeah it's Henry the computer guy and in this video we are going to be learning how to install the enable e-registration software onto our computer or PC then later be able to register our candidates so what you have to know first is that you have to be having the software with you it doesn't matter on any media you're having the software for example it can be a flash disk or it can be a DVD so for our case, we already copied the software onto our desktop and it's the one that we are going to be using. But before we start the session, we will also want to cater for those people who are having the DVD. We take them through uh, how they are going to be able to access the software from the DVD. So the first step is to insert your DVD into your computer. And when you insert it into your computer, the first step is coming to your PC or my computer and right click and open and see whether it is going to be displayed there. So you will come under the devices and the drives, then it will be displayed down here. So I've actually uh, created a, an image that has that information because my computer has no slot for DVD, so I'm not going to open the DVD. I'm just going to show you an image that has exactly the way your computer will look like when you insert your DVD. So when I click on this image down here, it will be the same as this. When I come to my PC, it will take me to the devices and the drives, and it will be indicated as the DVD RW drive, then a rig 2022, then that is the software you're going to be using. So what will you do first? You'll be opening this by right clicking onto it and click on the option that says open. So that is it for those people who are having the DVD. So let's go back and use our software that we are having. It is the same case that we are also going to be using. We are going to open our folder that has the software by right clicking onto it and click on the option that says open. And having opened it, we are going to come into uh, the folder, then we look for the option that says uh, setup and having seen it we are going to open it by right clicking onto it and click on the option that says open so you give it some time to load it is also preparing to install you're looking at it it is preparing to install so you have to be a little bit patient and they are going to ask us welcome to the installation wizard for e-registration 2022 of course we are going to click next next then you click install, install. Then you give it some time to load. So they will ask us, do you want to allow this app from unknown publisher to make changes to your computer or device? Yes, I will allow because I trust it. I'll say yes. Then I'll give it time to load all the files that are in here. So you have to be a little bit patient as you're waiting for the installation to start. So you have to be a little bit patient. We can, as you're seeing, the installation is taking uh, place. Uh, we are, we are, the installation is taking place. We have to be a little bit patient. We can close this file, we can close this folder that has the software as we are waiting for our software to install. You have to be a little bit patient. We are seeing the progress as our installation is taking on is soon finishing finally our installation is getting done so having uh, finished the installation it is going to actually ask us to click on to the finish button and finally our software has been installed so after installing that software you're going to go onto your desktop and look for the icon that says e-registration this is the software that we are going to be using we can open it first and see how it looks like so you can come to it and right click and come to the option that says open. You give it some time to also load. And finally, our UNEB registration software has loaded. So in the next video, we are going to be learning how we can register our learners up to the point of uh, submitting the information to UNEB. So it's been Henry the computer guy. And if, you, if I told you new to my channel, Please help me and click the subscribe button. You can also share this information to those people that need it. Bye-bye. I sign out.